everybody. I'm out here, decided to work on the camper. I've got this dual propane tank setup that I wanted to install. So I was gonna walk y'all through what I'm gonna do for that. So let's get that done. So I already got started just to see if everything will work. Uh, but basically the kit just comes with this little base plate here where I can set two propane tanks. All that was on it was this deal here from the factory. And it just sat back over here like that and held one propane tank. Um, but I want to have two, and so I bought that little base plate. Uh, my dad gave me a cover that I'll show you all here in a minute. So all I did was use my gun there and undid the self-tapping screws that they had in it. They had two, one there and one there that held on these straps to keep the one tank secure. And then there was uh, some holes back over here that you couldn't see. So I had to, so I just took those four out, put this in there nice and solid. Um, the other pieces to this, obviously this is going to go on top of your tanks and it's going to hold them both together. And then you've got this piece of, uh, it's kind of like all thread, but it's got a little nut down there. And this will just screw into it and then you'll set your two tanks you'll set this piece on top here and it'll those little notches will go over the tanks and then we've got this wing nut here to go over the top so let's get this thing assembled and uh, y'all can see it all right like I said we've got uh, this little cover here that goes over both tanks. Um, we're gonna just start filling these tanks on here, and y'all can see. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us, and love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah, no, I don't wanna waste what's left. And I Simple enough, nice little upgrade to uh, keep us going longer without having to worry about propane. All right, one more quick thing. So you've got this access panel on the top that just opens up so that you can turn on your gas. And uh, this is the wing nut that keeps everything tight. But what I ended up doing was because my gas line was not long enough to go up underneath here um, or over the top. I just ended up drilling rather crudely a couple holes um, with a drill bit and then some shears so I could snake through my connection there. And then when this tank runs out, I can simply unscrew it and switch it over to this side um, or buy one with dual connections on it if I wanted to. But for now, this is going to be just fine. So thank y'all. Through the highways, till my shadow turns to sun rays, and I. 